Good morning, scholars. So today we are going to continue with what we've been doing in math, which is um, subtracting or taking away. Um, so today we are going to look at an example problem that is kind of like what you're going to be doing on the homework. So <clears throat> first of all, Mr. Spivey had ice cream the other day, and he loves ice cream. So this is what Mr. Spivey's ice cream cone looked like the other day, okay? So I have my cone, and then I have my scoops of ice cream. So let's first um, count how many ice cream scoops Mr. Spivey has. So let's go ahead and count from here. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So I have five total ice cream scoops. So let's go ahead and write a five there to help us. So that's going to show how many ice cream scoops I have. Okay. And let's say Mr. Spivey, he has five ice cream scoops. So then Mr. Spivey ate two ice cream scoops. So let's cross off two ice cream scoops. Does it matter which ones we do? No, so I'll cross off that one and that one right there. So let's count how many I ate. Remember, I just said two, so one, two. So we are going to do five. Five is the number that I started with. And then I ate two ice cream scoops. So how many ice cream scoops do I have left to eat? So go ahead and count that. So I have one, two, Three. So this says 5 minus 2 equals 3. All right, friends, so um, let me show you the homework and read the directions. So the very first one up here is it says Tyler bought a cone with four scoops. He ate one scoop. Cross out one scoop. How many scoops were left? Okay, and go ahead and do that and pause. Number two, Eva ate ice cream too. She ate two scoops. How many scoops were left? Number three, there were four bottles. Three of them broke. How many bottles were left? All right, so friends, that's all the time we're going to have for our video today. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you uh, on Thursday. Goodbye.